This is Dr. Henry Borenson, and I would like to show you how we can solve a work problem visually. Jim can paint a wooden fence in three hours, and Tom can paint the same fence in five hours. How long would it take both of them working together to paint the fence, assuming they do not get in each other's way? To make things simpler, let's assume the fence is divided into three times five or 15 sections. Now, if Jim can paint the entire fence of 15 small sections in three hours, that means that in one hour, he can paint five sections. Let's see a diagram of this situation. Here is the fence divided into 15 sections. And here are the, in blue, the portion of the fence that Jim can paint in one hour, namely those five sections. Now we are also told that Tom can paint the 15 small sections in five hours. That means that in one hour, he can paint three small sections. And I've highlighted in yellow the portion of the fence that Tom can paint in one hour. Working together, Jim and Tom will be able to paint the blue and the white sections. The blue consists of five. The yellow, I should say, consists of three. So working together, Jim and Tom can paint a total of five plus three, or eight small sections in one hour. However, the fence consists of 15 sections. The eight small sections they can paint in one hour. The remaining seven sections they can paint in seven eighths of an hour. So the total time to paint the entire fence would be one and seven eighths hour. Now the answer can also be obtained by multiplying five times three, which is the total number of sections in the fence. And you divide that by five plus three, which is which is the number which are the number of sections that Jim and Tom can do in one hour. 15 divided by 8 is 1 and 7 eighths hours. Now, the process we have shown here can be generalized as follows. If one person can paint a fence in A hours and another person can paint a fence in B hours, then together they can paint a fence in A times B divided by A plus B hours. This is Dr. Henry Borenson, and I hope that you have enjoyed this presentation. Thank you.